Right, so this video is going to be on a quick Tennis HQ video that I really loved. And that Tennis HQ video was about staying in motion. And he was talking, which is awesome and something I've been working on my game with. And he talked about always staying in motion when you're hitting, always staying in motion. So, he, you know, he's right in the beginning. We work on stationary, which is hit here, swing and rotate. Now, hopefully we all teach similar things it's just saying it in a different way so i'm hoping by saying how i interpret it that it makes more sense to you for those who it didn't make sense to right because everyone learns in a different way um so here's my interpretation of that always being in motion is why i really hit the contact point in the rotation because if i make my contact point when i go out and i rotate that means my body's going into the ball instead of what a lot of players do which is where they stop and that's what he's talking about where they force it so i go and i stop and then i throw my body at it that's what you see a lot of juniors doing now um adult players too and again that, that goes back to my previous video i'm making which is stop trying to muscle the ball and just let the body motion do it all right so that's what he meant by keeping the body in motion just like a vertical jump when I go to jump down, I don't stay down for a long time and then come back up. Our body works like a spring, right? So I go down really quick, explode up really quick. Same thing with my stroke. You don't see, you name it, Djokovic, Federer, Dominic Team, you know, whatever biggest hitter you want, Ben Shelton. You don't see them just wait here. The ball's going too fast anyways, right? It's something, boom, something quick, bang. Thing. and it's more about timing and that's why when you guys play against better players I've never had someone come off the court playing against a better player even though they got destroyed and saying they played bad I did have them play against um, players junk ballers and say wow I played absolutely terrible that's why I lost coach and the reason you hit so well subconsciously when you're playing a better player is they hit the pace they keep the rhythm for you so your body's always in motion and you're always hitting all right you're always rotating and making contact at the same point and when you're playing a player that hits all over you have to absolutely know what you're doing and be able to keep your body moving and finishing rotation on its own and so players get there too soon the ball sits there and then they get tight because their body is not rotating and finishing out on the shot it's a quick spiel on that um and i'll come up with the next thing till next time guys